from Britain Computer Tech Tutorials. Today what I'm going to show you how to do is how to combine in a pretty easy way the textures of two different animals. So I've placed the head of a tiger under the body of a zebra and what I'm going to try to do is match these uh, and kind of merge the the two textures of them so that the colors blend kind of naturally uh, from one to the other. So the easiest way to do this uh, is to use a eraser. So let me show you how we do this. We're going to select an eraser tool, but we're going to change a few things. The first thing is we're going to change the brush. We want to use a brush that uh, erases out in an irregular pattern. If you use a circular brush, it, uh, it won't do quite as good of a job because you'll be able to um, see round circles in it. and You want it to do it irregularly, so it's harder to trim. This one I think will work pretty good. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to change the opacity down to maybe 20 uh, 25 percent somewhere in there and what we do is we make sure that we're on the tiger layer so we have a t uh, the, the tiger layer and we have the zebra layer so we're going to race out the tiger and t so the zebra starts showing through and we're going to work on this line what we do is we just keep pressing and I don't like to move it back and forth I just like to do it little by little and we continue to erase out just little chunks of it. And you can start to see the uh, texture starting to come through. I'm going to change the size of this a little bit. And I'm actually going to go to a flat one because I want to do a little bit more erasing right here. If you want to erase out fully, it is actually better to use a solid one. See how that will kind of match up with that. Then you can kind of just slowly erase out there. I want to erase out some more right there. I want the the main of the uh, zebra to show up more there and we continue to do that letting more and more of of the zebra show through while it blends from the uh, blends to the tiger now there's one more problem you got the the uh, the head sticking through here and the way I like to fix that is with the smudge tool I like to smudge the background to move that up so what I'll do is I'm going to take this background and I'm just going to make sure I'm on the layer of that and I'm going to smudge it up. And I'll continue to do that until I smudge it up out of the way, basically behind the head of the tiger. So you can see what I kind of did there. And it still looks like it's the green background, but we have, the, uh, we have that look in there. Now the next thing is you can actually smudge little bit this texture just kind of blur it just a little bit. You can use a blur tool as well. But that'll kind of pull that those colors back a little bit and see what, how it's more putting a little bit more of that uh, tiger color into the front half of this creature. So it makes it look a little better blending. So that's basically how you do it. So thanks for watching. Make sure to check the rest of my tutorials, Britain Tech Tutorials, on my YouTube channel. Thank you.